The field hockey team extended its season-long winning streak to four games by defeating Immaculata, Wells College, and Keystone College at Fitzpatrick Field. Congratulations are extended to freshman Alyssa Whitman, the co-recipient of the University of Scranton Athlete of the Week Award after scoring three game-winning goals during the period. The golf team improved to 6-0 on the season by defeating local rivals King Co King's College once and Wilkes University twice. Sophomore Eric Meyer and senior Jamie Bresnahan each shot a 76 in wins over Kings and Wilkes at the Wyoming Valley Country Club on September 24th, and Meyer fired a 2 under par 70 on Friday, September 28th in the win over Wilkes. The men's soccer team is now ranked 9th in the Mid-Atlantic region by the National Soccer Coaches Association of America. The Royals made history this past Saturday, September 29th, with a 2-1 victory over Merchant Marine Academy. It is the first time in school history that the team has opened a 2-0 in Landmark Conference play. Congratulations are also extended to the veteran head coach, Matt Pivarotto, who picked up a career, career win number 100 in the victory over Merchant Marine Academy. On Tuesday, September 25th, the women's soccer team extended its season-long winning streak to four with a 1-0 victory over Muhlenberg College in Allentown, Pennsylvania. Senior Sarah Gibbons scored the game-winning goal in the 38th minute, minute off an assist from freshman Sarah Andrews, and junior goalie Kelsey McElhaney made two saves to earn her fifth shutout of the season. Unfortunately, the women's soccer team's winning streak came to a close on Sunday, September 30th, with a 3-0 loss to Farmingdale State. On Saturday, September 29th, Senior Joe Mora picked up a career win number 41 for the men's tennis team, but the Royals dropped an 8-1 decision to Division II opponent Cootstown University. The women's tennis team was edged out by Lebanon Valley College, but junior Devin Cohen and sophomore Lisa Marie Lanciotti each posted a pair of victories for the Royals. The volleyball team went 2-2 two two during the period, but with a, opening with a 3-0 win over backyard neighbor Baptist Bible on Tuesday, September 25th. This past weekend, the Royals competed in the first round of Landmark Conference tourney play in Townsend, Maryland, and went 1-2. Scranton lost to Catholic University and Susquehanna, but emerged victorious against Goucher College. Congratulations to senior Janelle McFadden, who recorded the 1,000th kill of her career this past Saturday against Susquehanna. For This Week in Royal Athletics, I'm Michelle Lennon.